Welcome to another to food, the internet. food review from me, JD, my friend James. Hi. Today, we're unrelated. Jolly Bees. Jolly. Just shake the whole table. I, I like just lean on it and I, I let go of it and it shook it. Just a bit. hold the sides and Jolly shake Bees. Them. My god, this has been a while. This has been a while in, in the, the making. making. Uh, what crapshoot episode do you think I first brought up the Jolly Bees being built? Maybe around the time when you said you were gonna build your computer for like the second time, so about like a year ago ish. Oh, you mean now? <laughs> My god, was it a was it a process to get these things? We had to go and had to, to get here. We had to beat an old lady with a stick to get these uh, <laughs> to get these this food. No, we literally waited like fifteen minutes for them to And to prepare there was this also food. a lady beside us who was like, How long have you been it here? It wasn't even it wasn't even that uh was it, no. it wasn't even that much food. We just no, had two just chicken two combos, I think. Mm -hmm. We didn't get the spaghetti. No, we also didn't get straws. Yes, and for our drinks, we have, of course, Starry. Starry, our favorite brand. Please sponsor oh. us. Man, smell how we don't have, your nostrils. We don't have straws, so we're just going to have to drink it. Without the cat with it, threw it straight. You're so much missing from yours, I didn't realize. Well, no, I drank some. I, I know, I forgot that you'd been drinking while we were waiting. Mm. It's lost a bit of fuzz. Mm -hmm. That's okay, though. A bit of Let's fuzz. Eat. Let's eat a bit before it gets too cold. Normal. Hold on, let's, let's address this. Let's let it get cold. Sorry, my bad. Fizz. No, fizz. you said fuzz. Admit it. Okay, but I meant fizz. Okay, All right. let's just... So we're going to start with the fries? Let's start with some fries. So, official Jolly Bee fries here. Hold on so you can show... There you go. Jolly Bee fries. i am put this... Wow, down. there is not that many in there. You're right. I, I was thinking... It's a little cold, uh, but thinking, it's okay. I was thinking like, there would be more, though. Mm. First impressions? Cold. Obviously, it's not as warm as it could be. Hmm. Mm. It's okay. It feels. It tastes a little dry. I don't, I can't tell if that's because we waited a while, or because. Uh, oh, we didn't wait a while. Firstly, it came out cold. Well, we technically, did wait then. We waited like 15 minutes in the drive-through parking space. I think they had our out. food ready and they just didn't take it out and then realized they had to start taking it out. They're like, oh shit. So <laughs> they took it out to us. It was already kind of lukewarm then. And then we drove from there to here, which was quite a distance. So it's it's been even longer. So that being said, this isn't as bad as like some fries. Mm -hmm. If you wait just a little bit, they'll taste bad. Mm -hmm. It tastes like really bad if they get like cold or they won't uh, think this, these Aren't those type of fries? But because they're, they're a little they're bit not, thicker, they're not bad. Yeah, they're okay. It has a weird. It tastes a little sweet, actually. I don't know what they put in them. To me, it tastes a little sweet. Not that good. Might be the oil they fry them in. Yeah. Mm -hmm. they they're okay. Oil. I like I like them actually. This gets past some great for me. Mm -hmm. It tastes really good actually when they're even when they're not warm. Yeah. That's pretty good. I'll put that in that paper. We have other paper no, no plates plate, down here. No paper. Yeah. Let's get to the real meat of the meat of the meal here. I'm not a big fry person. Fuzz, paper. Any other flubs you want to make today? <laughs> Jackass. You see, I can just cut them all out. No one will, no one will ever know. I'm editing this video. <laughs> no, you I'm want not. to edit it, James? No. <laughs> you sure? Don't. I'm in too Go much on. pain and cannot. <laughs> Don't have All the right, time then. or the patience, James. The real oh, meat right here. What second. are these again? Chicken sandwich, spicy chicken sandwiches. Spicy chicken sandwiches. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. It already feels kind of. It kind still of big. feels warm as well. It feels a bit big. Mine doesn't feel very warm, but. Oh, mine like in the center a bit. Also, I like that bun. This bun feels pretty good, actually. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make a quick alteration to mine. Yep. Just gonna get the jalapenos off. Oh, oh right, it's spicy. Ah, I'm gonna see my head in frame. You can have James. James' opinion will be like the, the the normie. Yeah, the bare bones kind of plain thing. I'm gonna eat it with the jalapenos. First off, it looks really good. It does. It looks good. There's a lot of chicken in it, actually. And we, neither them. of us have. By the way, neither. Oops. Yeah, I'll forgive them for not giving me uh, straws. If this is really good. So. Neither of us have had Jolly Bees before, by the way. Mm -hmm. So this is our first time having their chicken as well as yep. Jolly Bees in general. Mm -hmm. 
So. Well, I've had it before, but I was so little, I don't remember it. So my my whole life has been a little, hold on, dink it and sink it. I like that crunch. It's quite crunchy. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I got a big mouthful in that first bite, and look how much is gone. <laughs> it's how much chicken I ate. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's good though, it covers the whole bun. I'm gonna need a second bite. Mm -hmm. Get more chicken in this one. I actually really like that. Mm. So it's a sriracha mayo mm -hmm. sauce, as well as a spicy chicken, I think. That's what I was tasting. I was like, this tastes familiar to me, but I can't quite place it. Okay. We think of the jalapenos on it. It's a jalapeno enjoyer. Mm -hmm. I don't usually eat jalapenos. It's okay. We don't. There's something very funny about them eating a banana. Yeah, my name. Neighbor over there is just, he's just chilling. We're not bothering him. Yeah, I wasn't wearing my uh, Spice Rat shirt today. I'm wearing my mm. Sauce Monkey shirt. Mm. So I'm a bit more into the sauce. Yeah, welcome to uh, our new podcast, Head Jelly. Uh, not inspired by anything. <laughs> and, uh, Which, by the way, is inspired by Space Jam. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, first impressions from those bites, it's pretty good, actually. The bread, the bread is pretty good. I think mm -hmm. the buns are pretty good. The the chicken itself is pretty crunchy. The crusty is the the crust is crunchy, and the chicken itself is not super dry. So it's pretty good. I can't really taste the jalapenos. I took a bite of it. I can't taste it. It's also not spicy, mm -hmm. but it tastes like it tastes. It tastes like it should be spicy, but it it's tastes not. like it's supposed supposed to be spicy, but mm -hmm. it's not spicy. It also doesn't taste bad. Mm -hmm. So it's a weird. It tastes like it's supposed to be hot, but it's not hot. So I don't, I don't the, know. The it's flavors weird. are messing with your mind. They're like, yeah, the flavors is not <laughs> because my brain associates this flavor with then a burning pain after. But it's like the you get the flavor, but then you don't get the burning pain. So it's weird. Anyway, is that what the name of these crab shoot specials should be called? Head jelly? No. The head jelly playlist, and we just never address it except this one episode. Mm -hmm. Mm. Yeah. Wow. That's pretty good. Yeah, my, I have to say... That trauma kept me away from some good shit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I say this is way better than Dave's hot chicken that, that we've tried before from the, our, our, our previous crap shoes special. This is probably maybe twice as good. Do you think I can pick you up and throw you over that wall? Listen, I get you're like, you're like Aaron Hansen with Wendy's, where you just really like Dave's Hot Chicken. But I'm sorry, James. Dave's Hot Chicken is just not very good. Like, I've had it, like, twice now, and both times were about the same, and it was just not good. Now, I'll give you something, I may James. be in pain right now, but I'll beat your fucking I can ass use, up I'll and give down you the something, street. James. They did give us straws. And they brought our food out in time. Mm -hmm. They didn't make us wait, and they brought our food But you know what? Here. I can make do without straws. Actually, genuinely, I do really like eating sometimes. And just drinking from a cup. Yeah. Uh, there's something, just something primal about it, mm -hmm. you know. Something, something makes you feel more like a man when you're not, when you're not having your mouth uh, wrapped around a phallic object, and instead you're just sipping from a, from a cold one. Sipping queer <laughs> beer. <laughs> sip, 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 sipping from a cold one. No, but like when I go to Five Guys, I like getting a burger and like a uh, some cherry uh, soda. Cherry one. This cherry feels iconic like with like sodas. It's it's like very classic to me for some reason. And just taking the lid off and just eating it, it's like this just feels very like old American kind of. <laughs> yeah, me too. Yeah, you're from here, right? No. Yeah. Are you a member of the CCP? No, I'm Singaporean. Do you have a Chinese passport? 
No. Mm. I'm actually surprised at how good their burgers taste. Well, being mine was cold. Her, it, it was all the warmth is gone from it. It's not like ice cold, but it's not. I guess it's still not still even a little bit warm. Me, my burger has lost all the warmth. It's no, there's no more warmth in it. But it still tastes really good, actually. What were your expectations for it? I thought it'd be good. Because everything I've heard from Jollibee's was that um, everyone loves it. Mm -hmm. It's got like the weirdest meals, too. Like I saw from like some ads that they got spaghetti. They'll eat like spaghetti with like the fried chicken. And they'll take like fried chicken drumsticks yeah. and dip it in the gravy or something. Yeah, that. I've always seen people do that. I was going to suggest we do it, but and I, was I was like, this is going to be no first. I was like, that, that looks weird. But nobody I've, I've talked to has told me Jolly Bees was ass. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. These are really good. I think it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Probably one of the better spicy chickens I've had. It's not spicy, though, so I'm just going to call it a chicken burger. Just conversion, of course. I <laughs> Oh, I've been, I've been talking, James. I know. I you. I know this is like a. Food I've been review. just. I've been just enjoying. This is a food review. I, know, I get the. I get the burgers really good, but. We gotta, gotta, what burger? I've been eating something. a chicken sandwich. Anyway, this chicken burger. If you wanted to eat something, <laughs> you like flinch noticeably at that. <laughs> if you wanted to eat like a. A spicy burger, but you're not someone who can handle spicy. Uh, like the feeling of spice a lot. I, I recommend this burger because you'd be able to taste it uh, Taste what spicy things like taste like but mm -hmm. not really feel anything because it's not it's not spicy It's almost slightly disappointing that it's not like as spicy as it tastes Because hmm. like it, it tastes spicy, but there is like no spice mm -hmm. <laughs> You sounded in pain Mm-hmm Sorry, I was just, I was just really enjoying it. <laughs> yeah, it's my turn to talk. Uh -huh. Here, you have funny in your chicken sandwich. I'll just talk for us. Uh -huh. It's so good. Yeah, first time for Jolly Bees. I'm even though it's cold, I'm happy it's not disappointing. Yeah, a couple things they could work on. Getting the food out faster. <laughs> a lot faster. Straws. <laughs> that would have been nice. Oh. And uh, yeah, that's about it. And having locations closer to us, or I guess there was a closer there, one. There's literally one just slightly up the street from where we are right mm -hmm. now. Mm -hmm. This guy wanted to just go to the newly opened one, so. Well, the whole thing is that the whole reason we put it off, we were like, when it finally opens, we'll do a craft shoot special on it. Mm -hmm. Then it opened after I stopped working at my workplace, so I had no clue. <laughs> mm -hmm. And we just never did one. And we did like Dave's Hot Chicken, and we did the Chuck E. Cheese, and you know, we're going to be doing other food ones as well. And I was like, <sighs> You know what? I want to give it to JD to see if he wants to do Jollibee or if he wants to do these other two ideas I had. Wow. And you know, he's like, Jollibee? So far, I think Jollibee's for me is, in the, is a top tier fast food, at least from taste, top tier fast food place I've been to. You know, I'd say, yeah, this is pretty good. You know what I wanted to do? Mm -hmm. A chicken sandwich. To, like, uh, like uh, we take a bunch of chicken sandwiches, you know, we like, cut them in half or something like that. Mm -hmm. We both take one, we take a few bites or something, and we see like what's the best chicken sandwich, in our opinion. Mm -hmm. So obviously we get like what's a chicken eight. burger tier list. <sighs> you know, yeah. it's, 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 nobody else getting cold like under their skin. Are you um, saying I can't speak English, now? Yeah. <laughs> Where are you from? <laughs> I, I never, I never add like this until we start recording. We start doing the jokes. <laughs> We're just like, I'm racist now. I'm like, the power of my family finally flows through me. Full power racism. Yeah. Finally, the power of my family. I can be more connected to my family. No, but it's good. How did you? Mine didn't even have that much sauce on it. Yours has spilled so much, and I can see so much on your burgers. <laughs> There's a lot of sauce on mine. It doesn't need to be that much sauce. I wouldn't say it's too much sauce either. No, but it's like still, it's still a decent amount. It's like, like I was saying, it's like almost just slightly underwhelming. When like you're eating, you're like, mm, the sauce is like really doing a lot of the work for the flavor. Mm -hmm. It's like I just wish maybe there that was, was more. The, that's the case for a lot of places I've been of, of fried chicken that I've tried. Mm -hmm. 
for example. Canes. canes. Mm -hmm. I think Canes' is chicken is not actually that great. By the but way, the sauce is really good. Terrible. And, the, and it carries the chicken. Terrible chicken sandwich, I feel like. Yeah. Their actual chicken sandwich, it's yeah. just a big bun with three chicken tenders on it and then like a bad piece of lettuce. Hmm. Better way to do a chicken sandwich at Canes, you get a three, uh, three finger box meal. And you just get like an extra toast if you want, but you just take the toast that comes with it, break it in half, put chicken in. Hmm. Really good. Kane's life hack with James. Do a little graphic right there, edit that in. Edit it. <laughs> I have to find like PNGs of Kane's chicken and then Damn the two toasts. <laughs> Green screen explosion. Yeah, Kane's I'd say was like a, probably like B tier, C tier. Yeah, the average. sauce does a lot of work for Kane's. Like, if you don't have the sauce for canes, it's, like, D tier. But I feel it's like... quite bad. I feel like one of the only places I really see seasoned their uh, chicken mm -hmm. uh, is Dave's. Like, as much as you mm -hmm. hate it and you're like, this is nothing, I think the seasoning they put on it is something that a lot of places don't properly do. Mm -hmm. Like, theirs has proper seasoning and it's also spicy yeah. seasoning. There is seasoning on, on this one, by the way. There is yes, seasoning on this chicken. there is. It's, I mean, Visible seasoning, mm -hmm. even. But no. get a little shot of that in the camera. I wonder, I wonder if I can bring it up there and see you can see the chicken Look at a bit that. closer. Look at that. Right? That's that's my bite from it. Yeah. So I'd say Canes is like C C tier ish mm -hmm. average. And then Dave's hot chicken is also C tier. I'd say it's average too. Um yeah. The, the chicken you the friends. chicken from Dave's hot chicken, for me, it tastes about the same as Canes. Um when we had it that one time. At one time, I'll have to bring that video back up to like remember it fully. But I remember not liking it very much. Yeah. I also thought the fries were really bad too. I think. And then, uh, yeah, it was just really dry. It was really dry. Didn't really taste like much. About about average, you know. And then um, below that, I would put Wendy's. I think Wendy's chicken sandwich, terrible. I think it's actual ass. I would not eat that. You see, what he's trying to do is start a fight with me. I'm just saying the stuff that I've eaten. I've also I'm eaten just saying a Chick Fil A. All thinking. I, I ate Chick Fil A with William one time. Um, and so I thought that was decent. Slightly better than than Kane's chicken and mm -hmm. Dave's hot chicken. Chicken. <laughs> I think. I think it's just slightly better. It's still. I think it's still not very chicken great. sandwiches are overrated. I don't think it's good. It's must so much better that it's in B tier. I think it's also C tier. Mm -hmm. I'll put that in C tier. Uh, I've had KFC chicken, so I'll put that about the same as Wendy's. Actually, I think that's they're about the same. They're pretty I think, bad too. I think that's also overrated. It used to be good. It's not good anymore. Mm -hmm. And I feel like the chicken sandwich that they tried to do. Now I could way vary. too much breading on it. Mm -hmm. Until you yeah, get there's the like chicken. no meat. Yeah, there's like no meat in the chicken. By the way, it might depend on where you live and di different KFC locations you've been to. But for me. The KFC chicken I tried, it was like mm -hmm. it was like 80% breading and like just yeah. a little bit of meat, and that little bit of meat was also really dried because yeah. it wasn't so much there. My dad to keep in moisture. My dad loves the chicken sandwiches from there, and he's always trying to get me to get one. Mm -hmm. And I'm always like, I, I can't explain this to you enough. It's not good. There's too much breading, and there's not enough chicken for that sandwich. Mm -hmm. It is so disappointing once you get to it. I'll say this: this isn't the best chicken I've had. The really? best fried chicken I've had. Uh -huh. What is? I've had Church's. Church's fried chicken, I think, is the best fried chicken. Okay, so this is something I've... I've never had Church's. you never had Church's? I've never had Church's, but I've always wanted to try it because I always hear that they Here's have the good thing. chicken. Church's chicken tenders, like chicken tenders, uh, the ones without the bones and stuff, it's about B tier. Without I the think bugs or without the bones? Without the bones. Without the okay. bones. Okay. I thought no I heard bugs, and I'm no, like, no, you wouldn't pass that way too casually. The chicken tenders, no bugs. their chicken with boneless chicken from churches is like B tier. It's better than Cane's, guaranteed. Uh, it's better than Cane's, better than hot Dave's hot chicken in terms of like the quality of the chicken and the meat, how good it tastes and stuff. Better than that. But they're um, they're like okay. mixed. They're like mixed fried chicken where you have like drumsticks in the breasts mm -hmm. and stuff. That is literally the best chicken fried chicken I've ever had. S tier. I don't think anything has come close. This isn't even this isn't even close to it. Uh, and this is still really good. A tier, maybe. This is if it was hot, A tier. This is A tier. Yeah. B tier, not hot. I'd still put it in A tier. Yeah, honestly, and it's I, really good. <laughs> like just because of the the way they seasoned it and the the, the way the sauce kind of like fits in with the seasoning and the chicken, and yeah. how strangely I'm almost it's, it being to cold, just have us go up to the, the Jollibee's nearest and get hot ones just it so being we can cold, see. 
it being cold and still tasting this good. Yeah. Like that's that's insane like that's to me. that's the most surprising part is that it was like it was not hot. Like mine was slightly warm in the center still. By the time I got the wrapper off it, mm-hmm. and it was still very good. The sauce held up. Oh, that's a good point. You know, the Matt Pat, when he did uh, the chicken uh, sandwich uh, for Food Theory, mm-hmm. he was like, we were talking about it, and then some of the chicken sandwiches got soggy and stuff, and then some just lost their heat. I feel like this is a very good placement of, it still tasted good despite those factors. Yep. Does Jolly Bee do like takeout and stuff? I think so, yeah. That's good, because then you would get this about like the same amount of heat retention, like about like this, and you'd still really enjoy it, I think. Mm-hmm. It's much better. Like. Uh, and these fries too, they're pretty good cold as well. Like they're not the worst. Again, would love to know how they are better. Like hot. These are C. There's about these are about B tier. What if they're cold, cold? hot? <laughs> Maybe I don't know. I don't that think would be I, I don't very funny. Them. I don't think I found That'd be a, a very uh, funny outcome. <laughs> these are about B tier, cold. A tier probably hot. So A tier, A tier. Um, hmm. An example of a fry that would be really bad once it goes cold. Kansas fries. Yeah. I don't know what happens with them, but they turn like super soggy, and when you eat them, the taste too. It tastes like shit. It tastes like shit when it, when it's when, it, when, when you, leave when it you out eat it hot though. It's good. It's like very good. When it's hot, it's like it's like okay to me. It's like B tier. Like this this amount this flavor with Kansas with Kane's like hot fries. It tastes to me. I get the same amount of enjoyability out of these two. You know what? Where has cold fries that are good? Pop Popeyes. Hmm. They're Cajun fries. I get them and they're sometimes That's the cold. I've like never them. had Popeyes. So we got to do an episode where, where you get Popeyes and I get churches. They're fried chickens. Mm-hmm. And then we both eat them. We'll do like a cut in half type thing or something. I've heard Popeyes is pretty good. It's so it's my favorite chicken sandwich. Which is so qu- I question because I'm like, I want to have this hot and have a Popeyes and see which one I like more. Because mm-hmm. Popeyes is my number one chicken sandwich. Fuck Chick Fil A. Their sandwiches are so overrated in comparison. Yep, they're okay. They gave you so many more fries than they gave me. <laughs> I'm like looking. Yeah, I've seen you've been eating these fries this entire time. <laughs> there's, there's quite a decent amount of fries. My, I was like almost out by the time like I had like my third fry, <laughs> and that's why I stopped eating. I'm like, okay, that's <laughs> there's not enough left. Mm-hmm. So yeah, you know, Jolly Bee, good job. Yeah, I might Great come back for one. Maybe. Oh, I'm sorry, you gotta go to Burger King. Or more like, I don't go to any fast food joint, so... Probably not, but hey, it's pretty good. I really enjoyed it. I thought it was very well done. By the way, 